Hello, this is Jane Goodall. I wish I was there with you in person for this important gathering. However, I'm speaking to you from New York where my body is, but my spirit is with you. I think every single one of you there knows that our planet is suffering. We face two major threats, that's climate change and loss of biodiversity. And it's mainly because of human activities. We're using up our natural resources in an unsustainable way. And, you know, there's around 8 billion of us on the planet now, and it's supposed to be 10 billion in 20, uh, 2050. So if we don't take action now to slow down climate change and loss of biodiversity, it's going to be a pretty bad state of affairs. We're creating, and you all know this, but this layer, this layer of greenhouse gases with our burning of fossil fuels and the other greenhouse gases that are trapping the heat of the sun. Many places <clears throat> have had the hottest summer since temperatures were recorded and the change in weather patterns is obvious everywhere. You know, the hurricanes and the flooding and the droughts and the fires and just, you know, you never quite know what the weather's going to do. We're polluting the air, the water and the land with chemicals from industry, from agriculture and from household waste. And we've really got to do something about industrial uh, farming, which is polluting the very soil with chemical pesticides, herbicides and fungicides. And of course it's terribly harmful to biodiversity, the insects, the birds that eat the insects and so on and so on. And when we come to animal uh, industrial farming, not only is it horribly cruel, we know these animals are sentient beings, but in addition to that, it's using up huge areas of land to grow the grain to feed them. And it takes an awful lot of precious water, which is diminishing in many areas, uh, to turn vegetable to animal protein. And then, of course, we've got overfishing and so many other problems that we are creating or making worse. And we mustn't forget the military operations around the world, the wars, the practices, they must be having a major, major impact on the greenhouse gases along with the terror and misery and suffering that war causes. And you know, we all know we need to make change, we talk about it all the time, but the time's now come for action for us to get together and do something. Words aren't enough. And although some people are making valiant efforts, we need to get together because, you know, the, the situation is so bad. There's still a window of time, but it is closing. And it's no wonder that people are depressed. And young people are getting more and more depressed. Suicide rates are going up in some areas. And although many are kind of giving up, there are those who want to fight for change. And we see this in the youth demonstrations, more and more youth groups springing up. Young people, when they know the problems and are empowered to take action, are changing the world. I wish you an amazingly productive uh, gathering. Again, I wish I was with you, but I'm sure that this will lead to great change. Thank you.